What are those? It's, 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 I don't even know. It's well, actually, it looks like they're like stars for this tournament thingy. Oh, the five star classic. You start with two stars and aim for five. The final duelist standing with five stars in pocket will face off for the grand prize. Oh, so it's like a sort of duelist kingdom style thing. You ever hear of that? It's, uh, it's a couple times. Yeah, so essentially we duel each other and we bet stars. And whoever has five stars, I guess in this case, will duel at the end for a grand prize. I wonder what the prize is. What do you think? Probably money, but... I don't know. It doesn't seem like this place has a lot of money. Oh, it's got to be like a rare card or something. Probably. I mean, maybe Exodia piece or something, but I kind of already have all those, so... Well, you have all the Exodia pieces? Yep. I do. Well, and I haven't geez. lost with this deck yet. So if you want to duel me to get my star, good luck. Uh, I, I, I don't know about that. See, like, my deck isn't, isn't that good. Whoa. Yeah. Uh, well, then I'll use my dragon deck with the... Uh. Well, I've been making a third deck. I haven't tested it at all yet, but it might be an even battle. It certainly shouldn't be any worse than your deck. So, if if you allow me to go down to the market, pick up a couple cards, you can pick up a couple too, and maybe we can duel with my fresh deck. How's that sound? Sure, sounds good. Let me just grab my credits real quick. Oh, uh, yeah, I should grab some as well. Excuse me. I would like some credits, please. Thank go. you. Uh, strange that they made the uh, stars for the competition look exactly like oh. the. Uh, oh, just got a cool card there. Is that the Eye of Tamias? Yeah, I don't even know how I got it. Must have like. Oh yeah, that like parrot that. is uh, just handing out cards. Oh. So. Well, yeah. Cool. That's a really rare card. Look. That's actually. Some people are going to be asking you to trade for that card. I'm just going to say. Don't trade it for nothing. That's a really good card for decks, like especially with like Dark Magician and stuff like that. Which is exactly, insane. exactly what I'm running, actually, too. So this is perfect. Oh, okay. Yeah, then you should probably use that yourself. Yeah, um, in fact, when we're at the shop, really I'll point out what you should buy so you can use that a little while. Because you have Dark Magician in your deck, and with the Eye of Tamias, that'll essentially be a fusion that can act with like other your Dark Magician, and bring you out some really powerful cards. Ooh. So, yeah. I have the uh, Fang of Critias, which works with trap cards rather than the Dark Magician and brings out some powerful dragons, which works for my deck. Tra so Trap it, cards? Yeah, only specific trap cards, though. Uh, like, for example, in my deck, it works with the uh, Crush Card Virus, Mirror Force, and the Tyrant Wing card, which only works with dragons. So Sounds really cool. So, yeah, but this deck I'm trying to uh, work on is a Harpy deck. I figured to throw some Harpy cards in my Dragon deck because, well, my field card helps both Winged Beasts and Dragons, but then I thought it might be fun to just make an entire Harpy deck. So I've been working on it, and now with these credits, I should be able to get everything else I need. So I'm trying to get, let's see, maybe not from you, but I need, ooh, that's a good card, um, but I need another Elegant Egotist. I'm definitely going to need a Cyber Harpy Lady. Harpy Sisters. I'm pretty much buying all the Harpy cards, if you haven't noticed. And what's really worth getting? Ooh, Ooh the Harpy Dragon. Queen. That's, that's the one yes, that's, see, right? that's the one you want to grab. Yeah, there we At go. least one of them that you want to grab. I think there might even be some more cards that you definitely want to grab as well. I'm not entirely sure, though. Let's see. Are there any other cool traps that you have for this? Ooh, Hysteric Party and Icarus Attack. All right, that's all the money I have, but it should make for a pretty good deck. I'll organize it later. That's definitely enough cards to start. Um, what are you getting? There's uh, there's the Amulet Dragon. There's uh, maybe the Fusion cards are on this guy. Uh, nope. There's this. Uh, let's see. Uh, do you run Dark Magician Girl? Uh, let me see. I don't think I have. But I, yeah, so I, I think know I probably should. Well, Amulet Dragon is your only thing. Uh, I don't know. Do I have a Dark Magician girl anywhere? I do. If you ever wanted to trade some, I don't know if. Uh, did I duel you for your um, Sphinx card? I think you did. Yeah. I'm pretty yeah. positive you did. Yeah, I can't really think of anything else that I would like to trade unless you got some cards readily tradable, because I do have a Dark Magician girl. 
Uh, yeah, I don't really have anything. All right, well, I'm pretty sure it's available when you buy some Yugi deck or something, so it's all good. But uh, yeah, I guess this Harpy deck is runnable. Maybe I'll just, uh, nah, I think I'll run it with the cards in it. It should be fine. Uh, I'll take out one of these uh, Sky Scouts because I don't need to water it down with other winged beasts anymore. In fact, maybe I can take out both. I should really count my cards. Hmm. So we got that there. We got that there. Then we got three of those. Then we got those and those. Yeah, that'll be enough cards, I think. If I take those guys out. Okay. So, are you ready to do? Yeah. Looks like it. All right. I think I got Let's head back up to the hall and uh, get to try out this deck. I... I'm not sure how it works, and there's a couple cards. I'm not exactly 100% on how to use them, but, you know, if something seems wrong to you, call me out. Uh, I know there was a couple of cards that I realized afterwards are not exactly used how I thought they were from one of my Exodia duels. Apparently, there's uh, separate rules for flipping up a monster and flip summoning a monster. So, yeah. Like, the uh, cards that I have right here, Swarm of Scarabs and uh, Swarm of Locusts, are very specific in their wording. So, I may have misused it a little bit. So, whoops. So, okay. that's the thing. You always got to be careful on, you know, what your cards do. And, you know, if people mess up, it's fine. But it's really just on the other person to catch them if they really care that much. Um, so, what color do you want? What color? There's lots of options. Mm, let's see. It looks like orange. There we go. Fair enough. I'll take the green over here, and I'm ready to duel with my harpy deck. Let's duel. Oh, boy. And yes, cool. I do have an appropriate number of cards. Heads or tails? Beaks or feathers? Let's go with heads. All right. Hey, your choice. Excellent. Uh, I'll go first. Very well. Let me just draw, so draw my cards. Hmm. Ooh. Not a lot of harpy cards. I can't. Not a bad hand. Let's see. For starters, I'm going to activate uh, my field spell. Oh. I've seen that one. It's a lot of attack points for dark monsters. Yep. And I'm going to set two cards. Do I want to play this now? Hmm. Hmm. Nah, I think I'm going to save that. And I'm going to set card face down and end my turn. Ooh, okay. Come on, give me a harpy card. I draw. Not bad, but not exactly what I'm trying to use right now. I really want to use this card. Hmm. You know what? I think I'm still going to... Nah, it's not worth doing. Ah, but you have a scary, scary field right now. I think what I'm going to do is summon... Hmm. No, I'm going to activate the effect of Harpy Queen from my hand. Oh. And I'll discard it to the graveyard, getting me a Harpy's Hunting Ground to my hand. So I just gotta look through my deck. Harpy's Hunting Grounds, there we go. And I'll put it onto the field. So that'll boost up all of my Winged Beast monsters. And I gotta remember to shuffle my deck as well. There we go. And I will set a card here, and set a card here. Okay. That'll end my turn. All right, well, I draw. Ooh. All right. Okay, that could come in handy later. But I'm going to activate Pot of Greed. Allow me to draw Ooh. two more cards. So that's what it does. Okay. Uh. Yeah, no, I'm not going to do that. Let's see here. Ooh, mm -hmm. that is actually, okay. Uh-oh. I'm going to normal summon Sonic Bird, and when this card is no okay. more flip summon, you can add one ritual spell card from your deck to your hand. Yes, you can. Which is what I'm going to What ritual card do you have? Ooh. Let's see. No, that's not what I want to do. Can I, like, click the card? There <laughs> you go, perfect. Ooh. And... Guess I'll shuffle my hand. And Very good. Hmm, I guess I'll attack using my Sonic Bird All on right. face down just to see what it is. And that is a winged beast, so you gain attack and defense as well. Ooh. Alright, yeah, you've attacked true. my magician of faith, but its effect doesn't even matter because it's too early in the duel. 
Okay. Hmm. All right. Is that all you got? Uh, let's see. Yeah, I'm going to end my turn. All right. I draw. Eh. I'm going to set one card and end my turn. Oh, no. Yikes. All right. I draw. Mm hmm. All right. You know what? Yeah. Might as well just do this. I flip summon. A giant rat. And I oh, that's a big rat. Attack your life points directly. Alright, as you go for that attack, I activate Call of the Haunted. This will bring a monster back from my graveyard. And that... Hmm. Yeah, that is going to be my Harpy Queen. That I discarded earlier. Uh, Would you still like to attack? Well, I actually activate my own trap card. Hmm. Uh, yep. There we go. Seven tools of the bandit. Oh. So So you just have to pay a thousand life points and negate it. Yep. Alright. That was a good use of that card. Okay, I guess I'm still open for attacks then. Yikes. Yep. Attack your life points directly. Alright. With the Harpy's Hunting Ground, that'll be a total of... Hmm. Three thousand life points. Ouch. Hmm. But there is an effect of Harpy's Hunting Ground. Ah, but it's not going to work because you negated the card before I summoned it. Otherwise, I would have started uh, to get rid of your spell cards. Ooh. Yeah, so I'm hoping to do that. I just need to draw a harpy. So, is that the end of your turn? Uh, yep. All right, I draw. Ooh, that's a harpy. Not a very strong one, but I can work around this. I will summon the Harpy Lady 3 in attack mode. Now, it's not going to be stronger than your monsters at the moment. However, when I summon it, I also get to get rid of one of your cards. So I'm going to get rid of... Let's see. Hmm. I'm going to get rid of your other face-down card. My drop card? Yes. Okay. Using Harpy's Hunting Ground. It was just a backup soldier. Ah, okay. So it wasn't fully necessary. But now... Let's see. I'm going to activate Cyber Shield, equipping it to my Harpy Lady 3, boosting her attack by 500, Ooh. bringing her up to a 2,000 total. And with that, let's see, I believe Giant Rat has an effect. So I'm going to attack the Sonic Bird. Okay. I should do Smart 400 life point damage. All right, there's a lot of weird additions and subtractions going on on the field right now, so we're going to have to keep an eye on that. But yeah. I'll end my turn. All right. Uh, I draw. Ooh. Hmm. Okay. For starters, I'm going to set him into defense. Okay. Uh, let's see. Yeah, I got 2,000 attack on this harpy lady right now. Yeah. Let's see. You know what? Yeah, I'm just going to set monster face down and end my turn. Okay. I draw. Not bad. Let's see. This one's equipped, so I probably shouldn't go summoning this. Hmm. Well, that's not going to work at all. I will uh, set one card face down. And... Let's see, I don't have any Harpy Lady to summon and get rid of your Mystic Plasma Zone. I guess I'm kind of scared of your face down, but... Worst case scenario, it's a Maneater Bug, which is going to flip up next turn anyway. So Harpy Lady 3, attack the face down. Just the mere Celtic Guardian. Okay, so I made the right choice. Whew! Alright, I end my turn. Alright, I draw. Ooh. What do you Let's got? See. Ah, okay. I want to play it, but I don't want to play it. You don't play what? it then. You know what? Yeah, I'm just going to have my turn. Oh. Okay, well, Giant Rat yeah. should still have his effect go off, but let's see what I can draw. Really? Hmm. It's not ideal. But I suppose I'll... Yeah, just so I can get rid of your Mystic uh, Plasma Zone... I'm going to sacrifice Harpy Lady 3. 
okay. to bring out. Oh, wait, no, I cannot normal summon this card. Never mind. Huh. That is unfortunate to draw both of that. I may want to run one less of those and many more Harpy Ladies in the future. But we're learning, so I think I'm just going to attack your giant rat to destroy it. All right. Well, I'm going to activate a quick spell. Mm-hmm. Increasing one face-up monster by 700 defense points. Oh, so that'll keep him alive. Yeah. Because that'll boost him up to 2,150, so I lose 150 life points. Mm -hmm. Okay. Then that's gonna Not bad. Uh, that's all I got. I end my turn. All right. I draw. Hmm. You may have the field, but you have a full hand right there. It's only a matter of time. Like, I could definitely do something, but I don't want to. <laughs> Just because... I don't know what... I'm Smart. I'm, I'm scared what your back row is. I do have some face-down cards. Who knows what they could be? Yeah, so I'm just gonna... I'm just gonna set one monster face down and then my turn. Okay. I draw? Hmm. Would have been useful earlier, but... I'll sit on that for now. Yeah, I think I definitely know one flaw of this deck. Uh, but I'll attack. I'll attack your face down monster. Okay. Ooh, Karibo. Karibo. So, uh, yeah, so he still goes to the grave. Mm -hmm. Alright, I end my turn. I guess I'll just right. go until one of us draws oh. a trump card here. Uh, let's see. I'm going to set a card face down. Okay. Actually, I don't know why I did that. Huh? Yeah, because can't you just get rid of it? If I summon another harpy. Okay. Or if I have another way to get rid of it. Yeah. Uh. Yeah, I'm just going to have to have my turn. Alright, give me another harpy, please. I draw. Um. <sighs> Such good combos in my hand, it's just I can't really <laughs> use them. Huh. So I think what I'm going to do... It's probably going to bite me later. But I... Yeah. I will activate Harpy's Feather Duster. Getting rid of all of your spell and trap cards. Uh... So. If you can activate it now... See if you can, but... Yeah, no, it's in the graveyard. Ah! Trap hole, so that could have even stopped the uh, summoning of a harpy. Yeah, anyway, that's exactly it'll also I get rid of your Mystic Plasma Zone. Oh, yeah, it's true, yeah. Yep. There we go. And finally, we'll attack and hopefully destroy the giant rat. Yep, it's destroyed, but... Yeah, uh, I don't have another monster to monster. finish off the attack, so you get a low attack monster from your deck, as long as there's an Earth monster. Mm -hmm. Let's see. Luckily, it's face up, so I don't have to worry about flip effects, but there's a lot more than that. It is Earth, so could be limited. Hmm. Uh, which one? I got so many monsters. Yeah, just make sure they're Earth. Um, you don't have to worry about getting attacked, because I used my only attack. Uh, aside from that, though. It's rock? No, rock isn't Earth, right? No, wait. Um, it could be. Or it could be. Usually is, I think. Um, but it should say, it should say the name of the monster and then Earth monster right below that. Okay, yeah. And then and then level, then type, yeah. and so on and so forth. I have one, but like, the NEI is. Well, it's a free level. special summon. You can just put it in defense mode. Afterwards. All right. Yeah. So I'm gonna choose. This guy, and I can summon him, right? Yep, in there attack mode. Ah, darn it, and he's going to be in defense mode, and I can't exactly beat that defense. Yep. So, since that is the case, so be it. I end my turn. All right, I draw. Uh, okay, for starters, I'm going to set that guy in defense. Not a bad plan. Ah, oh, let's see. I'm stumped right now. Um, 
Yeah, yeah. looks like it's about to be a stalemate. Unless I have another card that could get me out of this situation. Wink, wink. I'm going to set another huh? card face down and end my turn. I need something to get rid of that okay. field spell. Yeah, uh, unfortunately, right now, it's not helping me because you don't have any spells or traps. Um, but I'm also not drawing any harpies. Oh, ho, 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 ho. that's a card I needed to see. You remember that harpy feather duster I played last turn? Yeah. Yeah, here's the version for monsters. Ooh. From the sky calls down lightning. Regeki. Destroying all your uh, monsters. Okay. 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 Ooh, 2,000 defense across the board, too. <sighs> now we can finally do some life point damage. Um, yeah. But since I am going to start chipping in that life point damage, I better hold on to this. Uh, yeah, because I don't have, I'm not really going to be in range to defeat you this turn. I attack directly with Harpy Lady 3. Doing 2,000. Okay. And I end my turn, still with no more monsters to summon. Alright, well I guess that is kind of forcing me to play the turn I've been waiting on for a while. Okay. And Dark Hole. Oh, I don't have any way of stopping that from happening. So goodbye, Harpy Later number three, as well as the Cyber Shield equipped to her. And with hmm. that, I shall summon my warrior. Boom. Digrepher, okay. Yeah. And I'm going to attack your life points directly unless you have something. I do have something to defend myself. I flip up the fairy box. Oh <laughs> So, <laughs> when your opponent's monster declares an attack, toss a coin and call it. If you call it right, the attacking monster's attack becomes zero. So, I'm going to have to start paying life points to keep this on the field. But, I'm going to call heads. Ah, your attack is zero. That'll protect me. I will happily take the 500 life points as opposed to the uh, 1,700. Is that the end of your turn? <laughs> All right. That just broke my I heart. draw. <laughs> oh, and it's a good card I drew too. First, I'm going to have to get rid of seven uh get rid of 500 life points so I can keep that fairy box. And I have another harpy to summon. Ooh. Ooh. I forget. Is my attack However, Is my attack raised again this turn or no? Uh no, I don't believe it is. Yeah. Oh yes, no, it is raised to above 0. It's only during the battle phase. Okay. So your attack is 1,700. Fortunately, I summoned a monster with 1,800. But before I do that, I am going to set a card on the field. Because there's a minor downside to Harpy's Hunting Ground that you're about to see. I summon my Cyber Harpy Lady in attack mode. Hunting Ground boosts its attack to 2,000. Familiar number. And... I still have to destroy a spell card on the field, spell or trap on the field. So I'll get rid of the one I just set as fodder. The triangle ecstasy spark. Okay, that's smart. Yeah. Otherwise, I would have had to get rid of either the face down card or the fairy box, which I just paid for that. I don't think I want to get rid of it. Yeah, true. Um, so, Cyber Harpy Lady, let's attack the Warrior Die Greffer. Should destroy it and deal 300 life points. Alright. Uh, Suppose that'll end my turn. Alright, come on, how are the cards I draw? Yeah. Oh, <laughs> this is I Now I draw this thing. Okay. Oh boy. This is a really good card too. And like I'm not gonna, right now? Yeah, just not right now. Oh, that's a shame. Uh, Got anything else? Let's see. Uh, Your star is going to be mine. I'm just going to have to normal summon this. Ooh, okay. Silent Magician level 4. Yeah, and I'm going to have to end my turn. All right. And hopefully you draw uh, more than one card. <laughs> well, I certainly draw one card. So, yeah, that's, okay. that's increased by 500. Oh, okay, so you're up to 1,500 attack points now. Yeah. It's because you have a spell counter. Okay, yeah, I fought this guy before. Not bad. Uh, so, this card might actually be some use to me. Oh, no, it's not going to be any use to me. <laughs> Darn it, I need more harpies. Um, so, yeah, for right now, I should activate this card, but I... 
there's so many harpies still in the deck that I can draw. So I'm, I'm going to hold out. And Cyber Harpy Lady, attack the Silent Magician. Dealing 500 damage to your yeah. life points. Oh boy. Uh, that, I think you uh, missed one. Was that? Okay, yeah. Yeah. There you go. There you go. I thought you might have missed one earlier, but I wasn't sure, so I didn't say anything. But should be all good now. Either way, I am now in the lead, so I end my turn. All right, I draw. Yep. Mm. Ooh. Uh oh. This could work. All right, I'm a normal summon Neo the Magic Swordsman. Mm hmm. And I'm going to activate a equip spell. Oh, yeah, and I had to. Yeah, I forgot to pay 500 for my oh, yeah, fairy sure. box last time. So, I'm still ahead of you. <laughs> By I'm a little act tiny bit. I'm going to activate Acts of Despair on him. Gain oh, boy. A thousand attack. You are now more powerful than me. But yep. can you beat the odds? That's what I'm hoping for. So, I'm going to attack your Cyber Harpy, please. All right, every flip today has been heads so far. Let's call it heads. Are you kidding? What? <laughs> Zero attack points, sir. Take 2,000 damage. <sighs> Three for th uh, Actually, let me look at the wording of this. Let's see, the attacking monster's attack becomes zero. Yeah, not its original attack, it's just its attack overall. So, yep. Uh, it's destroyed as if well. If you don't have anything else, yeah, it is. Because you just attacked with zero attack points, yeah. essentially. Oh. Fairy box is expensive, and it's a risk, but when it pays off, it pays off. Heads three times in a row, oh my god. Yeah, look, they called heads twice on that. The chances. <laughs> uh, is that the end? Yeah, I have my turn. Alright, then I draw. And, uh, yeah, finally another Harpy Lady. Alright, um, let's see. I'll forego paying 500 life points. I'll summon a second Harpy Lady, destroying one spell in the field, being the Harpy's hunting ground. And I'll attack with the two harp Cyber Harpy Ladies, finishing you off. Man, Whew. I was really hoping on you not to get what you called. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that would have, well, I guess I would have been able to draw another, I would have just drawn another Sarp, Cyber Harpy later, but you would have oh, yeah, definitely taken some incentive there. Um, so, because I did have another equip card in my hand I was holding out on just in case a situation like that happened. Well, hey, it looks like I got three stars now. Yeah. Yeah, oh, I definitely gotta add some more harpies to this harpy deck. I guess it is actually leaning a little heavy on the spell cards, but there's so many good harpy spell cards. So yeah, I'm probably gonna add some more magicians because yeah, I also gotta take out a lot of cards because this this deck is yeah. I didn't big. see a lot of dark monsters there for having a dark field card. Yeah. So. Yeah, looking at some of my cards, like I got a couple of dark monsters. If you ever want to trade for them or anything. So, I got some legends here. Just, uh, and what else do I got? I got this uh, Dark Blade, who's a warrior. I got a spare Wall of Illusion. So, if you ever think of something that I might want to trade for, then let me know. I mean, that Eye of Tamias could be a great trading token, but I assume you want to use that. Yeah, yeah. I, I literally <laughs> warned you against people like me <laughs> earlier today. I probably shouldn't have made that warning in hindsight if I was going to try to make a move on the Eye of Tamias, but. You know, a uh, good duel. So I guess you still have one star left, so yep. you still have an opportunity to uh, keep going in a tournament. You know, just try to pick off someone weak or something and take their star. That's exactly Sounds what I'm like plan. Sounds like a good plan. <laughs> <laughs> nice. I guess I can uh, safely duel anyone I want, because I got two additional chances if I fail. So yep. I'm feeling fairly confident right now, but you never know. With new cards coming out, duelists can uh, spring up out of nowhere, I suppose. That is true. And I well, can hope to uh, upgrade my deck as well. Some of those new cards. Yeah, definitely. I uh, have a couple of adjustments I might make to my uh, my dragon deck as well to get Blue Eyes White Dragon out a little easier. But we'll see about that. Anyway, good duel and best of luck in the tournament. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I guess see you around. See you then.